Hello everyone, Reed Aberdeen with Safeguard Investment Advisory Group. We're a registered investment advisory firm. We've been in business now over two decades. Our primary focus is helping pre and retirees build and protect what they've spent a lifetime creating. Our main goal in doing these educational videos is to make you a more informed consumer. So, should you buy stocks? Should you buy bonds? Should you buy an annuity? Should you put your money in cash? I get all these questions and it really depends on where you are at this point in your life and what your circumstance is. So there's no such thing as a one size fits all. Boilerplate does not work in achieving financial success. So it has to be customized. So there are seven key areas that we look at in creating a customized approach for our clients. And each one of these are critical in making sure that all the components work together. So there's seven of them. The first one is risk. How much risk are you taking? Is it adequate for your situation? Are you taking too much or not enough because you're worried about markets. Number two, taxation. Gosh, you know what? We are trillions of dollars of debt. Where do we think that tax rates are gonna go in the future? Making sure our future taxes are kept under control, paying our fair share, nothing beyond. Number three, your cost. Gosh, I see people who come into my office and they're still unaware of how much they're paying in their investments. We don't do this when we buy an appliance, a car, furniture, yet people come in here and they're unaware of how much they're paying in fees. Number four, this one is really important for everyone. And that is, are you a candidate for Roth conversions? Because if you are, you should be taking advantage of these to immunize you from future tax hikes, which are inevitable. Number five, income planning number one concern for retirees year in and year out. How do you position your investments to where you've got income structured and letting your money grow? It's not just automatically just sticking it one place and hoping for the best. Number six, gosh, what happens if someone becomes sick? Our life expectancies are increasing. The dependency for care is rising with that. If someone becomes sick, are your investments designed to be protected or have you, do you have a plan to deal with long-term care? And last but not least, wealth transfer. Is your portfolio, is your total picture positioned that if you don't spend it, it goes to your beneficiaries, whether it be children, family members, charity, organizations, in the most tax efficient manner? Are all of these components being addressed so that I'm financially independent. I'm structured to be able to withstand the challenges that we all face in retirement. I wanna thank you for your time today. I hope this information has been useful. I encourage everyone to get a second opinion. Make sure all of these issues are being addressed with a seasoned advisor who is a fiduciary. If you like this information, click the like to subscribe. If you want to reach out to us to get a 15 minute strategy call to address some of these key points, please feel free to reach out to us. I look forward to catching you on our next video.